computer, you will go to your Seesaw or Google Classroom and your teacher should have a link posted in the class. You'll need to meet with your teacher to figure out where that class link will be. In this example, my link is in Classwork. So I would go to Classwork. I have a material for my daily group WebEx. I would click on that option to open. And then there is a link attached. So I'm going to click on that link to open the meeting. From here, I would then need to click on join from your browser, or I could install the WebEx Meetings app on my device. I'm going to join from the browser. You'll then type in your name and your Goose Creek Google email address. Then click Next. On the pop-up that appears, you need to allow WebEx to use your microphone and your camera, so tap Allow. Then at the bottom, you can set to mute or stop your video before you join the meeting if needed. Underneath that, you have the option to um, call in or use your computer for audio. Um, by default, I would use the computer for audio, and then it will give you um, where your speaker and microphone are defaulting to. And if you need to change that, you can tap on settings to change the uh, speakers or microphone if you have an external um, headset that you needed to connect to. If I needed to change my display name or email address in the upper left hand corner, I can click on that option to change it if I'm sharing a device with a sibling. And when I'm ready to join the meeting, I will click Join Meeting. Once in the meeting, I'm going to see the host appear um, large in the middle of the screen. If you wanted the options to be able to show grid view of all the participants, you would need to install the desktop app. Then I can also, at the bottom, click on the participants list to see a list of the participants. I can also click on the uh, chat option to open the chat window to chat with my classmates and my teacher. And if I need to, I can click on the three dots next to the chat bar to raise my hand if I need to raise my hand to get my teacher's attention. Also at the bottom, you can toggle on and off your microphone and your camera just like you did when you joined the meeting. Once you have finished with your class meeting and your teacher tells you it is time to go, you will then click on the red X to leave the meeting.